covering the week's top tech stories with a slight Linux bias. Researchers have developed an algorithm that could stop self-driving vehicles from getting into crashes and traffic jams. The algorithm divides the ground beneath the machines into a grid. The robots learn their position through technology similar to GPS and coordinate their own movements together through sensors that assess where there's free space to move. Northwestern engineers Michael Rubenstein says, the robots refuse to move to a spot until that spot is free and until they know that no other robots are moving to that same spot. They are careful and reserve a space ahead of time. Rubenstein's team tested their algorithm on a swarm of 100 robots set up in their lab. To cut out any distractions, the robots were only allowed to sense three or four of their closest neighbors. This restricted their vision, uh, it, and it made the system easier to scale, as the robots can interact locally without needing global information. Think about the impact of that. So the advantage of a swarm of robots is that there is no centralized controller that can disrupt the whole system. This allows them to work together to accomplish any task, even if one of them breaks down. This gives the system an obvious application in warehouse robots, but Rubenstein believes uh, it could actually also cut traffic and collisions for self-driving vehicles on the road. He said, quote, by understanding how to control our swarm robots to form shapes, we can understand how to control fleets of autonomous vehicles as they interact with each other. <laughs>